Hey guys, it's Kathleen from Vice's Brooklyn office. From Paris to Africa to China, we've got some incredible pieces for you to check out this week. Broadly went to China to examine women's rights in a country where feminist activists are persecuted and unmarried women over 27 are considered leftovers. We're in one of Beijing's many public parks and today in this one there's a wedding market on where parents come to advertise their unmarried sons and daughters. Yeah, that's me. Yeah. Vice News traveled to Karno in the Central African Republic, where Muslim and Christian military groups are locked in conflict. Motherboard investigated the new frontier of space tourism, package holidays to the moon, and zero gravity flights for the next best thing to space travel. What would you be able to sell me? At the moment, we can send you as far as the moon. Uh, we can't land on the moon, but what we will do is send around the far side, come to within about 100 kilometers of the moon's surface. And how much would that cost me? It would cost $150 million. As far as making space something that everyday people can visit, that's it's another decade or so away. On Thump, we premiered Black Dance Matters, our Will's Glass Beagle directed documentary on Chicago footwork, told from the perspective of the dancers themselves. I do think of footwork as an art form. It was born in Chicago, raised in Chicago. When you surrounded by violence or whatnot, you need something like footwork to take you out of that world. That's why it catches emotions like it does when it's in a room or on the stage. Thanks for watching. And be sure to subscribe to all the channels across the Vice Network. And check out Vice.com for more. Until next week, this has been the latest on Vice.